Hi, welcome to this DataCamp course on the valuation of life insurance products in R. My name is Katrien Antonio. I am affiliated with the University of Amsterdam and the University of Leuven as a professor in actuarial science and insurance analytics. I teach courses on data science for insurance, including life insurance, and I coordinate Leuven's master's program in actuarial and financial engineering. And my name is Roel Verbeelen. I hold a Master in Statistics and a PhD degree in Business Economics. I studied at the University of Leuven. Leuven is a splendid college town in Belgium, home of a superb collection of beers and chocolate, and also home of the founders of the DataCamp platform. In this course, you will take the role of an actuary who is dealing with the calculations behind life insurance products. More specifically, you will help a superhero who wants financial protection for himself and his family. That's why he will pay premiums to buy life insurance products from an insurance company. Our hero considers buying a life insurance product that would pay a certain debt benefit if he dies early. This debt benefit can be paid to his kids, his business partners, even his bank, in case he has a mortgage that is not settled yet. In addition to the risk of dying early, our hero also needs products that offer protection against the financial risk of a long life. Indeed, living long requires more money to pay for the cost of living, especially at older ages. You will study life annuities that pay an income while the annuitant is alive, like a pension does. You see that in all these examples, the future lifetime of the policyholder is crucial. Therefore, you will master the use of death and survival probabilities. Throughout the course, you will learn the key concepts of working with cash flows that represent financial transactions over time. Then, you'll work with a model for human mortality data. The combination of both prepares you to study life insurance contracts, such as life annuities and life insurance policies. You will do this by using R and specifically focusing on the use of factors and data frames, constructing insightful graphics and writing relevant functions for actuarial calculations. We hope to see you in the course.